Monday is tomorrow. I know you all get the Monday blues, but you needn't because as soon as you're done with your day, we're going to be here with Cricket Buzz Live and of course with a cracker game that's happening tomorrow because this is happening in Chennai. So you know the atmosphere is going to be amazing because uh, just like today, Virat Kohli went back to Chennai Swami. You have Mahinder Singh Dhoni who's going to be playing at Chapok. Absolutely. Did he not be... play last year though? Or, la, no, la, no, they were last, last year. Yeah, in even though. Oh, they weren't allowed to play in their grounds. Yeah, nobody so played on their own home grounds. Oh, so Because they said that there. if some teams get a chance to play in their home grounds, it's unfair for the others. Oh, so, so they were nobody played in Mumbai. Their own correct, home correct. They were playing in Mumbai, weren't they? Oh, so Chennai. So they Dhoni's going to be playing in Chepok. All right. If you are within a 10 kilometer radius of the Chepok tomorrow, Get some earplugs in because there's <laughs> going to be noise from about 5 or 5.30 in the evening. Uh, we, of course, are going to come here and make some dignified noise at uh, 7 o'clock. But uh, before that, let's quickly uh, look at the two teams and see if they make any changes. Remember, both of them have played a game each. So maybe uh, let's look at the Chennai team first. And uh, there you go. That's the 11 that was playing. That's uh, the highlighted. Uh, I don't think, I mean, they lost that game, Michael, but... I don't see them making any changes. Oh, hang on. Are Patirana and Tikshana no, back for no, tomorrow? No, still not. Back. They're not still, still back. No, Magala, Magala as well. So they left. Why, why are we talking? Why are we talking about Chennai and, and, and changes? We know they'll keep the same. <laughs> it's a formality. We're crossing the T's and dotting the I's. <laughs> yeah, they just need they need a few more runs. Obviously, they need a few more runs. the other day was excellent. They need they need some help in that middle order. Stokes and Mo now looks a little bit rusty. Um, I, I'm sure they'll get it right. I think Ben Stokes, with his knee problem and the fact that he can't bowl, he's now just in there as a batter. It almost puts him under a bit more pressure. Yeah. Not that he can't cope with pressure. He's probably the best I've seen in an England shirt of dealing with pressure. But when you are an all-rounder and then you're just a batter and you're just getting your, your fee for, for scoring runs, it just adds that little bit more pressure. When you can bowl two or four overs and just contribute, and he's that kind of character, he just wants to contribute all the time. Uh, so he's got to get his mentality just of being a batter sorted. He just looked a little bit rusty the other day. Completely depends on the surface. Could go for Pretorius over Mitchell Santner, but that we'll only know once you see the surface. Yeah, but I think it's the reverse. I mean, Because in Chennai, it's usually Yeah, exactly. Spin. You'd probably go there. I mean, Pretorius, if he didn't play there, I'm, I don't think he's going to play there. And I think Moin's going to get a chance to bowl. I'm just looking at their lineup again. But again, this whole dependence that, you know, an off spinner can't bowl to a right hand is something which I think is, you know, it's overdone. I well, I mean, today Ritik Shokin <laughs> would say I, I would have liked that analysis <laughs> to back me not bowling. Uh, but uh, yeah, at the end of the day, they're all good enough to bowl at anybody. So maybe we see that tomorrow. Yeah, why, you're right, Michael. Why are we discussing whether Chennai will make any changes? Because uh, they won't. Uh, for luck now, let's have a look at them. Will they make any changes? Is Quinton back for tomorrow's game? Quinton's not no? back for tomorrow's game. No, they were playing today, so he's not back tomorrow for sure. <coughs> Which means that they don't have that selection dilemma. They can still go on and play Kyle Mayers. Because <laughs> they really want to play him, don't they, after that knock in the first game? Mm. Absolutely. And I think I think somebody like a Jaydev Unatkut would find this kind of pitch much more to his liking than he's, for, for example, found the Lucknow pitch. I think there's a bit in there for him. The question is, do they sort of take out one of their fast bowlers, Avesh or somebody, and give in a spinner? But I think they're going to stay with what they have. They have Kunal Pandya, they have Deepak Huda. If they, if they need to throw the ball to those people. They got Krishna Gautam in last time as an Krishnapa impact player. So they had player. enough spin options as well. They had enough spin options as well. Yeah, and all kinds, reason. right? Yep. They've absolutely. got the off feet, they've got the leggy, they've got the left armor. Yeah. So they've, uh, they've got a few options as well. So it looks like that they may not make a change as well. Uh, let's uh, get some predictions in on player to watch out for, key player for you. Uh, for the Chennai team, for the Lucknow team, one each. Uh, well, Chennai, Chennai team, I have to say that it has to. Devon Conway has to fire for them because Rithraj cannot carry the burden. Okay. And Chennai has traditionally been a side that one, two, three contribute a lot with the bat. Yeah. If they do well, so if Devon Conway does well, both those openers fire well, then Chennai will have a good season. Excellent. And as far as Lucknow is concerned, I'll leave it to all Michael. Michaels. Look, no, I, I'm going to go Mark Wood because of his Pfeiffer, but also because I know he's going to be bowling to his captain of the test team. <laughs> I'm just, nice. I can't wait. <laughs> and he's, he's his Durham teammate, his England teammate, he's his skipper. Uh, I, I just hope that when Ben Stokes uh, goes out to face his first ball, I just, I, I'd love it to be Mark Wood bowling his first ball because I know it'll be round his uh, it'll be round his ear earlobes. <laughs> nice. <laughs> and also, also Wood bowling to Moen Ali. I'm intrigued by that uh, that kind of little kind of inner battle as well. It's uh, Mark Wood the other day was magnificent. You know, I love the way that he bowls. I love the way that, you know, I love the way tonight that uh, 
Siraj running and bowled quick, you know, with a bit of, of aggression. T20 cricket is pretty much set up for the batter to whack it out of the ground. So when you see a bit of pace and a bit of hostility, I think it's a great vision. Okay, I'm going to go with uh, Ravi Bishnoi and Moin Ali. <laughs>